If you ever wanted to know what goes on during a sighting consultation, then you are in the right place. In this video, we finish our conversation up with Ryan from Southwest Exteriors when he tells us all about the pricing process and how that's handled during a consultation. Let's go. Hey, Chris here. Welcome back to the Home Solutions channel and part two of our interview with Ryan from Southwest Exteriors where we're talking everything you want to know about a siding consultation. Let's jump back into the interview where I'm about to ask Ryan how Southwest Exteriors handles the pricing process, how they walk you through it when the design consultant comes out to your home, and how long some of those quotes are good for. The big question, yeah. are we going to get a price? at this consultation? I hope so, yeah. If not, we're not we're not doing our job. But uh, yeah, so you absolutely will get a price. It's not an estimate or a ballpark. I can't stand that, uh, you know, that terminology because it, it, it's so vague. And, you know, in that there's problems. You know, oh, well, I thought and you told me and I, you know. So we will give a precise down to the penny price um, for the entire work. And sometimes there's, you know, different options. Well, what if we do this and we don't do this? Or what if we add this? So we can put together, again, that, that word comprehensive, um, we can put together a comprehensive quote for whatever the scope of work is that you're, you know, that you happen to be looking for. How long is that price going to be good for? Yeah, as you, you know, as pretty much anybody knows that maybe, you know, even remotely connected to home improvement or shoot, for that matter, buying something from Home Depot, lumber, building materials, everything's chaos right now. So because of that, you know, we want to try to really find a, a nice balance point between, you know, of course, protecting our clients' interests and giving them something fair, giving them time to digest all this information that we're going to give them. But we also have to protect our business, right? We have to protect this company. Otherwise, you know, without this company, we don't have clients. So, you know, we, we really have worked hard to find that, that beautiful, you know, balance point where we give the clients what they need, you know, in a fair time frame to make a, a big decision um, and still protect the company's interest in terms of, man, I mean, we wake up tomorrow and, you know, read another headline of lumber, OSBs increased another, you know, 25%. It's, it's insane. So yeah, to answer your question, it's kind of a roundabout, uh, roundabout answer, but basically we have a 30 day price that we're going to give you that would be undiscounted, but it's protected against any of these crazy increases that are almost coming at us, you know, at warp speed on a daily basis. Um, so you have a 30 day price if you're just kind of kicking the tires, kind of new to this whole process, not sure if you want to or when you want to or how you want to. Um, but then for people that are more serious, which tends to be the majority of people that we meet with, we're going to give you a discounted price, uh, including a couple low interest and no interest options. Um, but those, those specific three options that we're going to present you with are going to be good for a full week. And how that's different, and again, this is where I say we, we really have worked hard to find a, a very nice, comfortable point between what's important to the client and what's necessary for the company. And in that, you know, in that process of doing that, you know, we've come up with a week time frame. So we're going to give you our full discount. You're not going to have to beg, borrow, steal for it. You're not going to have to, you know, wait while the guy calls his supervisor and all these other funny things that you hear in this industry. You're going to get the maximum discount that we are allowed to provide at the time of our visit. And that is going to be good for a full seven days. So, you know, again, when you're talking 30, 40, 50, sometimes 60 and above thousand dollars, you know, is it, is it really fair? Does anybody want to be put in the position of, okay, well, you know, the truck's running, I got to go, let's make this decision. I mean, who, who wants that? And, you know, consumers nowadays, that's not, that's not a, a, a warm and friendly experience. So we would never ask anybody to do that or put that kind of pressure or put that kind of haste in a decision this big. So we give you a full week, you know, full week with the maximum discount as if you did it today, um, in which to make the decision and, you know, really come to the conclusion that's best for you in a way that you feel good about it. Now, is there anything that I can do or the client can do to prepare for a consultation? Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, just, it sounds simple, but just have the time allotted. You know, it's a big decision. It's a big investment, um, especially when you're talking about something as significant as tearing off the entire exterior of your house. 
probably warrants more than 15, 20 minutes, right? So the single biggest thing that anybody could do to prepare for a visit is have the time and attention, you know, set aside that the project warrants, right? Uh, if, if we're talking about a, you know, a $5 gizmo gadget, whatchamacallit, whatever, that's a little different than a $50,000 major exterior renovation. So that's the biggest thing is just, just have the time and attention available. I know life is crazy. You got distractions, you got kids, you got to run people somewhere and pick people up somewhere. Um, but really carving that time out and really dedicating that time and attention un, you know, undisturbed will honestly pay off biggest dividends to, you know, to the homeowner. Um, so, uh, you know, aside from that, you know, just a Kind of a sidebar would be just look around the neighborhood, see what you, you know, neighbors are, especially nowadays, people are doing home improvement projects at a ridiculous pace. It'd, it'd be pretty unusual for you to drive through a neighborhood down a street or two and not see a major overhaul of any kind of house. So drive around, take note of what your neighbors are doing, see what you like, what you don't like. So that way when the, you know, the design con consultant does come out to visit with you, you have an idea of, hey man, we saw this, we love it, we, we want to do something just like this, have pictures, Pinterest, whatever. Um, and, in li and likewise, man, we saw this, it's terrible. We'd never do this to our house, you know? <laughs> Poor neighbors, but it happens. Um, so having that understanding of what you love, what you don't like, you know, is, is crucial to the, again, the project being an ultimate success. Thanks for all the great information. And there you have it, everything that you could want to know about a siding consultation and maybe even a little bit more. If we missed something or you have another question that you'd love to have us answer, make sure to leave it in a comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. Thank you for stopping by the Home Solutions channel where we just want you to have the look you love coming home to. Take it easy. If you want more Home Solutions, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video. You can also leave a comment below if you have any other questions. We'd love to hear from you.